This turbulence is pretty intense. I don't think you've experienced anything quite like this before. Yeah, me too. It's making me really nervous. I remember a flight a few years ago that had turbulence, but this seems worse. We're expecting some turbulence in a few minutes. Yeah, I had a similar experience back in 2018. We were flying over the Atlantic, and the plane was shaking for a good half hour. I was terrified. Oh my gosh, that sounds awful. How did you cope with it back then? I just to stay calm and keep my mind occupied. Listened to some music and focused on my breathing. How about you? What happened on your flight? It was on a trip to New York. We hit a strom over Midwest, and the turbulence was so bad that the flight attendants had to sit down. I remember clutching my seat and praying for it to end. Oh, that sounds really scary. Did it last long? It felt like an eternity, but it was probably only about 20 minutes. Still, every second felt like an hour. I can imagine. This flight was already delayed because of the bad weather, and now this. I have a meeting that really can't miss once we land. Me too. I have a presentation that I need to get to. The delay is making me so anxious. I just hope we get through this turbulence soon. Same here. Do you know what causes turbulence like this? I mean, I know it's air currents and all, but what makes it so severe sometimes? From what I understand, it's usually due to weather conditions like storms or changes in wind speed and direction. Sometimes it's clear air turbulence, which you can't even see coming. That's what makes it so unsettling. It can come out of nowhere. I guess we're right in the middle of a storm now though. Yeah, it seems like it. I checked the weather before we took off, and there were severe weather warnings all over our route. Figures. Just our luck, huh? Do you fly often? Not as often as I used to, but I've had my fair share of flights. And you? I travel quite a bit for work, so I'm no stranger to flying. But no matter how many times I fly, Turbulence like this always gets to me. I hear you. It's hard to get used to, especially when it gets really rough. I keep telling myself that planes are designed to handle this, but it's still nerve-wracking. Exactly. I read somewhere that, pilots go through extensive training to deal with turbulence, so I try trust that they know what they're doing. That's true. I also remind myself that planes are incredibly safe, statistically speaking. It's just that in the moment, it's hard to think logically. Definitely. I always think about how many flights happen every day without incident. It's just a matter of getting through this part. I agree. Keeping that perspective helps, but it doesn't make the experience any less scary. No, it doesn't. I wonder how long this will last. The pilot said it might be bumpy for a while. I hope it doesn't last too long. I'm trying to stay calm, but it's hard. Same here. Do you have any techniques for staying calm during turbulence? I try to focus on my breathing, and sometimes I listen to calming music or an audiobook. Distraction helps. Good idea. I have some meditation apps on my phone. Maybe I should try one of those. Yeah, that might help. Anything to take your mind off the bumps. I'll give it a shot. Do you know if the flight crew gives updates during turbulence like this? Usually they do. I think they're probably just as busy dealing with it right now. Hopefully, we'll hear something soon. I hope so. Knowing what's going on always helps me feel a bit better. Me too. It's the not knowing that makes it worse. I'm just glad we're not alone in this. Absolutely. It's comforting to have someone to talk to. Makes it a bit easier to handle. Definitely. So, what kind of work do you do that has you traveling so much? I'm in sales. So I visit clients and attend conferences pretty regularly. What about you? I work in marketing. This trip is for a big client presentation. It's really important. So the delay is stressing me out. I can imagine. I have a similar situation. I'm supposed to meet a potential new client, and this delay isn't helping. Hopefully, we'll make it on time. Fingers crossed. Yes, fingers crossed indeed. I'm sure we'll manage somehow.